pistols around this bridge, fellas. You best clear off. Shoot the fool! Okay, girl. Please! 
Come on, girl. understand this at all.
What's the problem? Problem? No, there's no problem. Quite the contrary. Well, there is a problem. For me, but not for you. All right. <laughs> I ain't got time for no, this. No, no, wait! Give me a minute of your life. I might just change it forever. I'm sure you will have heard of me. Maximo Cristobal Valdespino, the renowned explorer. Can't say I have. There has been much written about me. I once had high tea with the Viceroy of India. I helped liberate South America. I've climbed mountains and swum across seas. I have had many women. I have spent the last three months hunting treasure on the American frontier. Beautiful country. Reminds me a lot of Almeria. But tomorrow I set sail for the island of Shikoku in the Japanese archipelago in search of the legendary Tokushima Sapphire. Hmm. Well, good for you. No, no, hold on. You see this map here? It was made by the Jack Hall gang. They robbed banks all the way from here to California. Yeah, I know who the Jack Hall gang are. Oh, them you have heard of, but me? Huh. Well, uh, rumor has it they buried gold somewhere in this area, but were killed before they could retrieve it. They created two maps to ensure it was well hidden. This is the first and should lead you to the second. You just need to follow the landmarks drawn here. Me? Yes. Unfortunately, I am out of time now, but I am prepared to sell it to you for the low price of... <gasps> Ten dollars. A trifling investment for a man such as you, given the potential returns. Ah, oh, what the hell? Why not? A very wise investment. I wish you the best of luck. Good luck to you. Mr. Morgan, I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your God has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. I'm free. I. I can't, partners. I don't mean to spoil your fun, but I got things to do. You sure? Quite sure. I got to get him out of here. Off him. Say a word. You'll keep. Use. 
Get out of it! Get your hands up! Oh my god! Killed him! I'm gonna keep the law on you! You're a fine man, Arthur! Damn it, Reverend! Hey, you! Get back here! <sighs> now what? Where's Reverend? Just a simple mistake. You can still be saved. What have you done with your foot? It appears to like this place. It wants to stay. Get your foot out of here. Twist your leg, you drunken bastard. Help! Help! Get it! You. What the hell is wrong with you? Throwing me off a bridge like there that! There was a goddamn train, you crazy bastard! <sighs> Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? I'm sorry! Uh, I wish I was different! <laughs> Let's get you home. Home? Yeah, that's a wonderful idea. I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret? Who's Margaret? But...
okay, no, I dealt with it. Mars is gonna fall off. Speak! Don't cry, boy. Speak about your gang. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. <laughs> boy. Whoa! Hold your horses there. It seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue. I was thinking Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? <laughs> I told you, mister. I told all of you. I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. I just been ridden with them for a Horse while. Horseshit! You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on! Ah! Uh, <laughs> who am I kidding? One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Geld him. Oh, yeah! What's he doing? Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. Just gonna cause you trouble. You know, in Imperial Rome, Unix was among the happiest and most loyal of courtiers. Oh, you're kidding me, right? Of course. You sick bastards! Oh, what do you want from me? Well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or after we got these little fellas off. Okay, okay, listen. I know where old Driscoll's hold up, and you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. He's at Six Point Cabin. Oh. Um, I'll take you there. Serious, I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you, no offense. Oh, none taken. Okay then, partner. Uh, uh, Why don't you take a few of us up there right now? I got this, Dutch. Should be fun. All right, you. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Let's both hope you ain't trying to trick us, O'Driscoll. Um, I ain't no O'Driscoll. You sure as shit was. John, Phil, come here. We got a social call needs making. Where are we heading? Uh, we're up into the hills behind Valentine. Uh, but I'll show you. John, you take this little rattlesnake with you. Any nonsense, you kill him. Sure. You're gonna pay your buddies our respects. He taking us to Cole? That's what he says. Come on. I'm taking you to him. Look, I I'll give you more directions when we're close. But if I know where we are, it's up past Valentine. All right, I'll leave. Hey, get back on the horse. Passing you. Sharing saddle with an old Driscoll. Who'd have thought? How many times I gotta say? I ain't an old Driscoll. You sure look like one, and you smell like... God damn. You smell like one, too. I smell like horse shit. That's right. Boy, are you high. Morgan, you got throwing knives in your saddlebag. Dud said that you might... I was asked to give them, and I'm doing you the further courtesy of telling you about it. Next time you want to give me something, how about you give it to me, instead of hiding it somewhere, hoping the opportunity comes up to mention it? Last goddamn favor I did you. Hey, hey, if I got my bearings, it's over here. Yeah, I know this country. Take this track up through the rocks. Morgan, you didn't tell me what the O'Driscoll smelled like before you asked me to ride with him. That's because you wasn't asked to ride with us. You was told. Well, I smell like a stall ain't been cleaned out in a month. I smell like that because you had me tied up there about as long. You'd be smelling worse if we'd done what someone was arguing for. 
Granite, granite. I was in with a bad lot. I'm trying to make amends if I can. You don't know the half. I do know Combe killed Duchess Sweetheart. And that's the man you chose to ride with. A woman killer. Well, it was after he killed his brother. And the way I understood it, the... Making excuses for the man and his crimes. What kind of trap you leading us into, boy? I ain't. I'm trying to help honest. One thing goes wrong. One thing other than you smelling funny, you're the first O'Driscoll will shoot. Now we go left, the uh, road will take us up and round. Those are the hills. Head for them. Save your horses. We gotta climb, boys. You know, you all ain't that different from the old Driscolls. What did you just say? I've been watching you all these weeks, and, uh... You've been tied to a tree. You don't know nothing about this gang. Yeah, well, I, I'd say you don't know much about the O'Driscolls. But maybe I know more about you than you know about them. And I know all about them, so... <laughs> Tell us this. How are we like those mongrel dogs? Where are you outlawed like eyes? them? You're out to survive like them? You live rough. You live hard. Fighting the law, nature. You're out for yourselves. See, this is why you're an O'Driscoll, O'Driscoll. You're out to survive. We're out to live, free. Cohen's a sneak thief and a killer. Dutch is, Dutch is more like a teacher. From where I've been, you just look the same as all. Then you looked, but you ain't seen. John, shut that boy up. Okay, now, now cut left up here. We, we go down the hill into the forest. We're going in quiet. Taking them out as we find them. Trying not to set things off. But if we do, we move quick and hard. We settle this like we know how, okay? Okay by me. With you, Morgan. All right, then. Through the trees here. Hey, we're real close. I'd leave your horses the other side of this clearing. I'll get my guns off. A horse, and I'm ready. Easy, Bill. Quiet. This is it. The cabin's just the other side of this hill. Okay. Off your horses. Let. Go. You gonna get them knives? I said easy. Follow me, all right? It ain't far. We might have shared a horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you every moment. I ain't gonna shop. You now, come on. It'd be suicide. You'll die, boy. But you'll lose your balls first. Jesus Christ. Hey, there, there, you see? Okay, get down. The cabin's in the clearing down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there, too. Are these fellers armed? Armed? Drunk? Wary of strangers, yup. And Colm O'Driscoll? Well, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. And over there, someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we ain't got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. The feller that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait so you can tell him yourself. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm, yes, yeah, sir. Come on, shake it off. Come on. What are we doing about the pisser, Morgan? One by, by the tree. I'm gonna deal with this first floor. Okay, go to work. We're here. We don't need nothing else from you. He's down. Don't you damn move. Now we got a real fight. Come on. It's on. We move quick. We move hard. Come on then. We caught him on the drink! Where's uh, uh, none of them, Janet? Out of here!
right? Sure. Thank you. Uh, <clears throat> Como Driscoll. He ain't here. You set us up. Come here! What? You set us up. No, I didn't. You did. Como Driscoll ain't here! He was here, I swear! I sw I mean, if I was setting you up, I, I wouldn't have <laughs> saved your life. It's a good point, Arthur. All right, then, go on. Get out of here. Hey? I won't kill you. I didn't set you up. You lost. Shit, lost. I'm letting you run away. Now, go on. Get out of here. That's as good as killing me. Out there, without you, Como just was going to lose his mind about this. <laughs> so? So I'm one of you now. <sighs> Give me a break. All right, then. But I'm warning you. Oh, hey, I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash in the chimney. I'll check it. Rest of you boys, get to camp quick. See, Arthur? I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing. Just yet. Yeah, right you are.
At least you got something tucked away.
am mighty glad to be out of that cold, Mr. Morgan. Me too. Oh, I am getting too old for this gallivant. <laughs> Me too. <sighs> yep. One night when I was frisky From toolish poked and whiskey Like the waves on the Bay of Biscay I began to tumble and roll 